Welcome back. Uh, it is so great to see you. Thank you so much for being on the show. I have to acknowledge Questlove, though. His that documentary, Summer of Soul, yep. was. That was Congratulations. it. Congratulations. Thank you. He nailed it. Uh, every time you're here, we always have a good time. I want to talk to you about everything, but first, I want to talk to you about you're, you're, you're an unbelievable actor, you're an unbelievable activist, uh, and then you changed the entire game with the Jane Fonda workout. Oh, yeah, there's, yeah. Yeah, that came out 40. <laughs> I was doing, I was checking out, it came out 40 years ago. Did you have any idea that it was going to be as yeah. big? Oh, absolutely. It was totally strategic. The timing of it, not. <laughs> I took a class with a woman, a talented woman named Lenny Kasdan, and it became a blockbuster, and I did not expect it, the whole thing. You know, I got all these musicians to give me songs because it came out first as a record. And, of course, they all agreed to it because they didn't. They didn't think it was going to be anything, and they didn't even ask for a you know percentage or anything like that. Yeah, they just said, well, I have, this is the, this is the workout album. You, this is the album right here. Look at this. You have, you have Jimmy Buffett on here. You have Ario Spiegel. The Jacksons are on here. Uh, this is a great album. You, I think you invented the very first gym playlist. For sure, yeah. Yeah. Who knew? Who knew? This is it. But yes. is, what, what, what is the uh, exercise playlist you have today? Oh, honey, there is no song slow enough <laughs> for me to do a workout to. It's is that all, right? Oh, I'll take your time. I'm almost 85 years old. You can't move fast. Wow. Yeah. You, you, look you look so good. Yeah, uh, yeah you look pretty good yourself, too, I must you. say. We're uh, all talking about it backstage. Uh, I, look, uh, I want to... <laughs> Uh, you know, you're always doing something new, and last time we were here, we were talking about the live stream series you did, Fire Drill Fridays. Yeah, still doing it. Yeah, it brings awareness to climate change, but now you've taken it a step further, okay? You've launched the Jane Fonda Climate Pack. That's right. Can you tell everyone about this? Sure. Well, you've got you've to have the rallies, and, the, and, the, and we're going to do in-person rallies again. Tune in to Fire Drill Fridays on Fridays, and I'll tell you all about what we're going to be doing leading up to the midterm elections. But what, what I've learned, what we've all learned, is that it's not enough. The, the fossil fuel industry has a stranglehold on our government. They give money to Democrats and to Republicans, and we've got to get rid of those types that take money from the fossil fuel industry. And we'll replace them with climate champions who really will work for the people and not for big corporations. That's what the Jane Fonda Climate Pact does. And <laughs> yes. I think I think we all want this. Next week, I'm gonna I'm gonna be in Michigan for Andy Andy Levin. I'm gonna be working for him. I'm for Barbara Lee, for Donna Edwards. I mean, there's some great climate champions out there that we need to support because tens of millions of dollars are into trying to defeat them. And so, if you want to join us and find out more, the Jane Pack. PAC.com. Yes. Jane Yeah, Jane Pack. That's what I'm talking about right there. I That's love that you're it. doing that. We all want it. We all want this. Uh, when, when, uh, when, when you're not busy saving the planet, you're also still uh, doing uh, movies. And I just saw this cast right here. If I can just show a picture of this. Some awesome VIPs here. But one person sticks out in my head a little bit. This is uh, Rita Moreno. This is Lily Talman. Tom Brady. Sally Field. Yeah. Tom, I said Tom, Tom Brady, yeah. <laughs> that's, I mean, that's really Tom Brady. Oh, he's so cute. Yeah, he really is. <laughs> and nice. He, out he's he nice. is so cute and nice. What is this? It's a, it's a partly true story about four women in their 80s who, well, Rita's 90 and Sally's 75, but who's counting? Who's counting, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> who, who, are, who have a real thing for Tom Brady for all kinds of reasons, and we have adventures. <laughs> we go to the famous game in Houston where they were down, way, way down, oh, and yeah. they came back. That's the He's game He's done some amazing oh, things. Oh, my God. He's kind of a magician, that guy. Yeah. I, have you yeah, met But Tom? I had a scene with Gronkowski. <gasps> See, my character writes sex novels about football, so I wrote... She wrote a book. She, she wrote a book. Oh, I like this. What? Well, she wrote a book called Between a Gronk and a, and a Hard Place. And... <laughs> <laughs> I had a funny little scene That's with the Gronk, funny. and, oh, man, is he, he funny. He's a great guy, too. He's tall. fun. He's a blast. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, uh, well, I want you to come back, please, when that film comes out. But uh, we're here tonight to talk about... Uh, you, you, you play 
the dragon in Luck. I do. This beautiful animated oh. movie. Uh, She's a great character. I mean, it, it, that's fun to do. Yeah, do, do you like doing voiceovers? Have I... I've wanted to break into voiceovers and a feature film. This is my first feature film. Um, <laughs> partly because I love animated films, partly because I'm old and it's a really good gig for an old person. You don't have to worry about how you look and your hair and all of that kind of thing. <laughs> you know, you just go and have fun. And yeah, it was show really up in your pajamas fun. and yeah, and you go with Yeah, you can go in your pajamas. And she's, you know, she's very flirtatious. She's the CEO of the Kingdom of Luck. Yeah, I love the story about it all, it's too. It's a wonderful story. It is fun, and they know how to do it over there. They're over at Apple yeah. uh, TV+. Plus. Yeah. I want to show Sky everyone dance. a clip. Here's Jane Fonda as the dragon in luck. Take a look <laughs> at this. Twice in one day, you were on the luck floor this morning, right? Yes, that was me. I thought so. <laughs> luck levels looking excellent as usual. See you next week. Oh, I'm so happy there are so few creatures here I can actually look in the eye. We lucky ladies of stature ought to stick together, don't you think? Yeah, come on. That's Jane Fonda in luck. Uh, I, I, I always love having you here. I'm honored that you come and do our show, and we always have fun together. And I thought tonight, we like to play games on the show, and I thought, would you like to play a game? And you said yes. And then I told you the type of game, and you still kind of said yes. But you haven't said no, but now we're live on TV, so you can't really say no. <laughs> so when we come back, we're going to play a game of egg roulette with James. <laughs>